Power and Emory TV, I'm very excited to be sitting here to announce the Extraordinary Men's Network group just launched 10 days ago. I'm sitting with the founder, Andrew Michael Horton. Andrew, welcome to EA TV. Thank you very much for having me, Amos. Pleasure to be here. Well, Andrew, I'm excited you're here because you're a member of Catapult Program, and Catapult Program is, is where we're using... Um, all our resources and ENT can help blow up your Facebook group. And you got a big mission. You want to help a lot of men that are probably suffering on their own, feeling like they're all alone in the world, rise up to become extraordinary men. So can you tell us about Extraordinary Men's Network, please? Thank you. Yeah. Um, so we started. I started the group just uh, about 10 days ago. And it's a community, online community, for men to there's there's two facets to it i guess there's the side where we are looking for inspiring looking to give hope and confidence and then there's also the side where we want to share our triumphs and victories we we are a network of people of men who have overcome challenges whether it's in our jobs professionally or in our family lives and personal lives and we're also going through going through the trenches right now. We've got our, we've got you know troubles and struggles right now that we're going through. And we want to reach out and and share with each other what we're going through. You know, a lot of dudes are used to fighting the battles alone, not talking about things because is it safe if I talk about it? Will I be judged, shamed? But you, as the leader of the Extraordinary Men's Network. You know, you've been pretty open about things you're going through. Can you give people a bit of a context of what your life has looked like and how it's transformed the last few years to where you're able to rise up to this position? Yeah, well, I mean, just a few, well, I mean, I could tell you exactly how many days, but it's about 1,035 days ago. I was very deep in my alcoholism and my life was sucked. It was, it was horrible. Um, I was very, very, I'm so grateful that I met my wife when I did. And I'm grateful that she stuck with me for a, a you know, a solid year of just drunken mess because she's, she, she, she stuck with me and, you know, I found AA and I got sober and my life completely transformed. When I met her, I was a mess, just drinking whiskey from the bottle, consuming just a lot of terrible things and then a light appeared at the end of the tunnel when i met her and fast forward three and a half years i've got three well my third kid is on the way i have a full-time job in a university in seoul south korea and i'm a life coach for men and i've started this amazing network where already within just 10 days we've got about 52 extraordinary individuals who are being interviewed and sharing and and it's 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 amazing so what would you say to guys that either need a community of brothers and or have something they've done that could encourage others? Yeah, I mean, it's if you haven't had the experience before of sharing your achievements, and it's not easy to say that. Like, it's so easy as a man to, to downplay what we've been through and overcome. They are achievements. They are conquests. You know, I love when you say slaying the dragon. Like we, we when, if you've slayed a dragon, it's a service to be able to share with other men that you can do that, that it's possible. Because when you're down there and you're staring up at that beast, it feels impossible. You know, it really, it feels like an unsurmountable challenge. And yet it, we've done it. Whether they're small challenges or big challenges, we've overcome it. And sharing that with other guys, like put your hand up, and say, I've done it. You can do it too. And share, share your story, share your inspiration and hope. And I look forward to speaking to them and sharing so you, them. So if you're an ENTV and you either are a dude and, and you would fit that criteria or you're here and you know some dudes that need to be here, please check out Andrew's group. The link's above in the post. Next to Network. Andrew is uh, someone that is very easy to like. 
He's um, he's a welcoming, as you can see, he's authentic, he's vulnerable. I'm pleased that we get to promote him as one of our sponsored groups here on Power Network TV. I would encourage you to check it out. Go in and tell your story. It's a safe space for men. It's a brotherhood. And then to see where Andrew's come from, even since I've known you, dude, to see how much you've risen up and you continue to remain vulnerable and authentic in your in your processes, which I find inspiring because you're not hiding behind, you know, a bunch of BS. You're just being real. You're on the battlefield and you're you got some scars, but you got your sword in your hand and you're being real. And that's inspiring. Thank you. I I, I just love that vision of Yeah, you, you paint a vivid picture, Amos. Thank you. It's a it's an honor to hear you say that. Well, thanks for being part of the Catapult program, the, the beta crew. Love that you're here. And um, I look forward to promoting you every month that you're in the program here on ENTV and having you in Catapult Games, which start in April. It's going to be a blast in this group there. Any last closing words you got for people watching? I, 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 I'm just dying with anticipation to hear these incredible, extraordinary guys' stories. I, I, the interviews and the roundtables that are coming up, it's going to be fantastic. And yeah, please reach out if you have that story to tell or that struggle to share. We can't wait. Beautiful. We'll end it here. Thanks, Andrew. Everyone, check out the links in the post. Andrew, would love to see you there if you're a fit.